Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know about a small yet significant change that Microsoft may be bringing to the Edge web browser in the future. Now, as many of you may know, currently in Edge, uh, there is an option that lets you reset the sync in the browser. So basically, it lets you resync the data um, in the browser if you are experiencing any issues syncing data in Edge on your different devices. Now, currently in the stable version, version 109, if we head to our profile settings and we click on sync and we head to the bottom of the page, this is currently what the setting looks like. Reset sync. The description reads, if you're having problems syncing browser data across your signed in devices, try resetting sync. Now, if we head over to Edge Canary, which is a preview version of the browser, and we head to the profile settings in Edge Canary version 111 and we click on sync and we head down to the bottom of the page again and Microsoft has brought a couple of changes and it reads in Edge Canary now resync data to this device. The description reads if you're having problems syncing your browsing data to this device try resyncing. This is recommended if you are missing sync data on this device. Now if we head back to the stable version and we click on reset sync this is what the reset sync dialog looks like. This will delete your browsing sync data from Microsoft servers. Browsing data on this device will not be deleted. And now if we head over to Edge Canary and we click on resync, it now reads resync data to this device. We'll merge your local browsing data with your sync data stored on the Microsoft server. So basically, the long and the short of all of this is that in a nutshell, instead of deleting the browsing sync data from the Microsoft servers, Edge will now delete the sync, basically the, the sync um, data that's cached on your local device. So for Edge Canary, that's actually stored on your local machine. And what this does, it will allow the local browsing data to be resynced with the sync data stored on the server. So that's the difference between resync data to this device now being tested in Edge Canary, as opposed to how it currently is in the stable version where it just uh, resets the sync which will delete your browser browsing sync data from Microsoft servers and not the data on the device. So that's the difference. And just wanted to point that out to you in case you're interested. And as yet, um, it's still early days and it's not known if Microsoft will follow through and push that out to the stable version. But obviously I will post and let you know accordingly if any more info becomes available. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.